Uh, but first, we have our Player of the Week from this past week. Gainesville JC's Player of the Week presented by Jacobs Media. Mr. Morgan Lee got to go to West Hall High School and talk with the quarterback down there, Chandler Newton, who had an outstanding game, and Morgan gave him his award. Well, Chandler, obviously, big win last week. Talk about uh, how nice it was to kind of get some forward momentum at the start of the sub-region season. Uh, it was good. I mean, we had a we had a game plan going into Walnut Grove. We wanted to execute our passing game and establish our running game much because usually we've been relying on the the run in the past four games. So we wanted to really balance our offense. But this thing is good momentum going into Johnson and our rival with the Battle of Oakwood. Absolutely. You know, talk about that game. I know you've only been involved in one of them, but the last three have been kind of crazy. I guess you've had a chance to see him from the sideline. What makes this game so just incredible? So, I mean, being on the sidelines, being a ball boy for my dad for the past three or four years, just seeing this game is different than any other game. It's just two Oakwood schools going in high scoring. You know, it could be high scoring, it could be a defensive game. It's just people know the intensity of the game and what no one knows how the game will ever turn out. Like, it's, it's always a question mark of how the game's going to turn out. Gotcha. You know, as far as yourself, I know, you know, just a sophomore this year, talk about how you feel you've progressed as a quarterback and, and how you're playing so far this year. I mean, I'm, I think I'm playing decent. I could be playing better, but, you know, for what we got, we could, we could be a lot better than what we are now. But being a freshman last year and having a couple playing times at quarterback, you know, really helped me settle in, see the lot, game go a lot by slower. You know, it's not really fast to me, so... I mean, I go to a lot of quarterback camps and everything. You know, my dad being the coach's son, you got to be on, on, on point every time. Sure. He's always riding me, making me hard, being a leader, though. I gotta, that's the one thing i got to work on is being a better positive leader and everything like that with being a sophomore. You know, obviously, y'all had a rough start on, on the scoreboard, but, you know, with that win last week, you know, everything's been kind of a race. Everything's kind of started over. You know, talk about what you feel y'all can do going forward. Well, uh... We have a lot more confidence with that big win. You know, scoring 38 points is big for us because usually we're scoring 7-14. You know, moving the ball, moving the ball down the field, making big plays with our offense. And our defense played really good, really good. And our offensive line is, is the best game they've had all year, all season, blocking and pass protection and everything. So overall, everything's just good, but we still have things to work on and come back Friday and try to get a W. Absolutely. You feeling pretty excited? Oh, yeah. I'm excited. Oh, I'm excited. Great. Well, congratulations. Thank you. Thank you. Chandler Newton right there. Uh, congratulations to him. 211 yards passing, three touchdowns. He ran for another 59 yards and another score. So he, doing it all the way around. Uh, he's a coach's boy. Not a bad interview either. Um, and uh, he's right. I mean, the offensive line didn't get to see the game, but I'm assuming the offensive line had their best game, as he said, because got to see them against East Hall. Big, formidable line. And uh, I know against Esau, I mean, those guys are just sliding right through there and getting to the quarterback every time. So if that offensive line can come together, they can, they can put together some wins. Yeah, again, as we said uh, at the start of the program, they've got a lot of ability. It's just uh, they've got a lot of youth as well and a, a lot of kids that are still trying to get used to, I, I guess, leadership roles on that team. Um, I, I believe that this is a squad that can improve. And, you know, of course, uh, Coach Newton talked about it uh, earlier, or well, talked about it with me yesterday, and it, they were in this position last year. They beat Walnut Grove, and uh, had had some momentum going forward, and they and they, they lost a lot of it in a loss to Johnson, and and you know what has become the craziest game in possibly North Georgia. So, they're uh, they're they're focused on on trying to. You know, get a win, and how, however it comes this this Friday night. Yeah, absolutely. So, congratulations to uh, Chandler Newton. He is the Gainesville JC's Player of the Week, presented by Jacobs Media.